Hi, my name is Aaron. I am an account director at a communications agency and I use Miro and I give it a five out of five. So before I started using Miro, I tried a number of different tools like pictures in, in Google Drive. I use PowerPoint. Um, I use flow charting software. Um, the problem with all these other softwares is that they are single purpose and I like Miro because it kind of does everything that all the other tools do. I needed to uh, create a rather complex flowchart. I had used uh, real-time boards which is what Miro had been renamed long ago and I sort of forgot about it. But uh, what really helped me choose uh, Miro because I realized once I got back into it that they had made so many improvements and it was ab able to help me make flowcharts plus many other kinds of diagrams and, and pictures and outlines and all kinds of ways of organizing uh, outlines visually. Well, Miro has a ton of integrations with other softwares. Very easy to make the linkages and um, it's it also communicates with Drive and all kinds of popular tools. I would highly recommend Miro to anyone who is having trouble laying out information graphically. It makes it very easy. You don't have to be an artist. The only thing is there are a lot of really convenient integrations, but when you, when you apply the integration, you may find that in order to fully utilize the integration, the software you're integrating with may have a charge, or an extra fee, or an upgrade that you have to pay for in order to, to uh, integrate with Miro. So that's one thing that um, you have to watch out for.